Hey, what's up? This is Mikey for Ride One Up, and in this video, we'll be taking a look at the front wheel wobble. There's actually just a couple of things that cause the wobble, and what are they? Weight distribution and the steering assembly. We can totally fix this together because Ride One Up has your back. Let's take a look at the weight distribution first. And as a point of clarity, we're not talking about the total weight on the bike, we're talking about how it's being balanced. The more weight that is put on the back of the bike, the less traction that the front wheel has. If you have saddlebags on the back that are full of lead weights, and also if you drop the seat so far down that the rider weight is pulled back and then ride up a steep hill, all these things will combine together to make the steering quite wobbly. This is super easy to address when you know what's going on. All you gotta do is avoid the combination, ease up on the cargo, lean forward for the hills, and of course, get your seat in the right position. We have a video link in the description below to go into great detail on getting your seat for just the right fit. If you're experiencing a wobble on flat ground without cargo, it's gotta be the steering assembly. The handlebars will shake side to side and increasing the speed will actually magnify the issue. This is super easy to fix, and it's also really easy to identify. Assuming that the front wheel is on there straight and tight, this general area around the logo, that's where we're gonna be focusing our attention. What should be happening is that the frame of the bike, which by the way is colored blue in this case, it should be lifting up with the stem. If the stem kind of rocks away from the frame a little bit, then we found our culprit. It's super easy to fix. All we have to do is follow the procedure for tightening it up. First, we loosen the stem pinch bolts, these two guys, one here and then one here. Next up, we loosen the stem top cap, which is this one right here. Now that we've opened it up, we can put it back together. Put your hand down and pull up on the underside of the fork and then seat the steering nice and firm in the center of the frame. With this in the right spot, tighten up the stem top cap first and keep going until you can let go with both hands and the steering doesn't rock or tilt. With this tight first, now we can move on to getting the steering straight. All we gotta do is align the handlebars and then tighten down the two pinch bolts. There we go, that should do the trick. Now that the steering is properly assembled and the load weight is evened out, the steering should be more smooth and predictable on the bike. If you've tried both of these fixes, there is another possibility. If the bike was ridden around for a long time with the stem not properly assembled, then the bearings between the fork and the frame might have become damaged. In this case, it's really easy to swap out. We just follow the previous steps of assembly and get it right from the start. If you need any of these specialty parts or have specific questions, feel free to reach out to our support team.